Hi, so I'm back. <clears throat> How are y'all doing? I know you're just waiting on bated breath to watch the next video. So here are the, fi here's the finished product, my potato latkes. Can you see those pretty good? Yeah. So they are golden brown on both sides, which, um, and then the clarified butter just makes them very crunchy, which is what you really want. So I'm gonna take these and I'm gonna serve myself two. I'm gonna get one of the bigger ones and one of the smaller ones. And then, you know, I said you could, most people, if you go to a restaurant and they wanna serve you potato latkes at like a Jewish deli or something, um, then they're gonna want <clears throat> to know whether you want <clears throat> they're going to want to know whether you want sour cream or do you want applesauce with it? Or either they're going to bring you a little bit of both to the table. So I have this handy um, squeeze of sour cream that I saw in the store. I, I know you can't believe this. Oh, oh my gosh. This is crazy. Let me show you this. This is a secret. This is how you gain weight. If you're trying to keep your weight up because you're on chemotherapy and you have no taste buds whatsoever and you can't taste anything except for lemon and things that are tart, this is great. Because this is a squeeze, all you do is squeeze it out. Oh my God, <laughs> this is crazy. Okay, so now that I've shared that secret with you, I'm gonna squeeze a little bit out on this plate. How fun does that look? Oh, I think I want a little more. Oh yeah. There you go. And the other thing that I'm gonna have with my brunch is <clears throat> an old fashioned pear salad. Does anybody remember what those are? Oh my gosh. My mother used to make those um, and it was really nothing. I mean. All she did was lay some, um, some lettuce out on a plate with pear slices or pear halves, and then she put a dollop of mayonnaise, and then she would sprinkle cheddar cheese or grate cheddar cheese over the top. So that's exactly what I've done. Here, you've got the lettuce, the pears, I've got a dollop of mayonnaise, and I sprinkle some cheese. And there you have it. You have an old-fashioned southern pear salad. That's what we did. Now, I've seen it where you can sprinkle pecans on top and you can get all kind of fancy or whatever, but I'm just going with the regular old pear salad with my potato latkes this morning. So happy brunch, everybody. It's a little early for brunch, but it's 11 o'clock and I'm hungry.